Hi guys, this is AC Gamer back with a new video on Alchemy Stars. Now in today's video, what I'm going to be doing is pushing ahead in some of the story content. As you can see, I'm currently in chapter 6, 13. The reason why I'm actually relatively slow compared to most of the other YouTubers out there is because I actually started a little bit late on my brand new account. Obviously, I had to go ahead and reroll multiple times because I didn't like my original account. So right now, it's been like 4 days since I started my new account. 4 or 3 days, actually, let's see. We can actually go ahead and check. Is it this? so currently my fourth day as you can see so right now i'm still at chapter six i will try and go all the way to chapter eight within the next two days so i can go ahead and make some more content on the game now i actually am planning to make some showcases so tell me down in the comment section which character you want me to do a showcase on i will try and listen to what you guys actually want to know um i think i might do korax next in my showcase just because i actually like the character but anyways let's go into some story stage don't forget to like the video subscribe stay tuned for more content on alchemy stars let's get to 10k subscribers at 10k i will be doing a giveaway so definitely stay tuned for that now i will be making my giveaway video very very soon so also stay tuned for that let's go over to the stage i recently ranked up so therefore i have quite a bit of stamina so i might go ahead and do like two story stages in the in today's video and go over my current team that i'm using as you can see i am running the mono water team i'm using midgard as my captain just because she is very very good i believe sniper characters are actually very very good in this game because the amount of damage they can do is quite huge and i believe sniper characters are very very good as a captain unit in fact when i tried to use the rest of my other characters as my leader the damage they dealt wasn't that good compared to midgard so we're going to go ahead and do this let's see if we can do quite a bit of damage and uh, yeah there we go this is going to be relatively easy my characters are leveled up quite well and i don't think i'm actually really stuck in anything so this is going to be great especially having midgard doing a ton of damage sorry about that little lag um, let's take a look at Korox damage. Korox damage is quite huge. Let's see. Is he able to do it? Yes, it is. Oh, wait. What happened? Why did the damage reduce by a lot? Um, we're gonna try all oh, my days. I hate characters like that. They stun. It really sucks. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and do this. Um, actually, no, we do. We do this instead. Go this way. And, yep. Yeah, perfect. Obviously, I wanted to go for the blue tiles, but um, just to increase the amount of damage I did or the length, I had to go for a different tile. Now, how am I going to go all the way to that tile over there to attack that person? There is actually nothing I can do. So we're just going to move little by little, I guess, until that person comes next to us. Wait, those are the mobs that spawned the lightning. I knew it. I fucking knew it. This is going to suck. Yeah, but I knew it. This is going to suck. I need to kill them. I need to prioritize killing them first. On my days a second time i wouldn't even want to kill them so i'm just going to do this obviously don't waste your abilities like that but i had to kill them i really hate um hate them as a character so let's see next wave um is there anyone spawning yes we got one over there so what i'm gonna do using teleportation gonna go over here um let's see yeah we'll go over here thank you with this, I have actually set it up quite nicely. Usually I would use my abilities, but I'm nowhere near to the main boss. So what I'm gonna do, because I really wanna kill that, we do this, go over here and do this. Yes, should be fine. Hopefully we kill that. Yes, we did. Perfect. That is very, very good. Now I don't have to worry about any of the other mobs out there. And yeah, make guard over here doing a ton of damage. And is Korax gonna attack? I don't think he will. Actually he might, Let's see, his damage, oh my days, why did the damage reduce again? Don't really like that. Now, I'm going to show you some very, very cool skill. Actually, I could do that, or I could do this, this, or maybe like this. Actually, no, I will do this. Let's see, how much damage are we going to be able to deal? Thank you, and then we're going to do, well, I should have aimed for the boss, but it doesn't really matter. We're going to do this. This is fine. It's not going to kill, I don't think. Okay, it did kill. Perfect. With this, we're gonna do that, that, that. Wait, okay, we do this. And I think that should be it. Hopefully Midgard is able to use her sniping ability to kill that person over there. And yep, yeah, okay, perfect. So as you can see, having Midgard is fantastic. All my units really work well together. Flishy over here, healing up my units, so perfect. Skip through the story content. Actually, I don't really care about any of that stuff. 
Um, I want to summon again, so maybe we will do some summons in today's video as well. I will try and get some of the water characters, but right now I don't actually like my luck. Um, so we're going to go ahead and do some boss stages. 6, 14. I don't think this is going to be too hard. Go again with our same unit. Now the one thing you should know about Korax is he actually isn't going to be useful in this stage at all. He's not going to be able to do any damage at all because if I press this, if I try to make him go all the way to there, he's not going to be able to do any damage. So Korax is going to be useless. I probably should have switched him out, but I didn't actually have any other water character that I could use. Um, I could try and push ahead in this. Yeah, but it doesn't really matter. I just want to get closer to the boss. Okay, we're not winning to the swiping ability. So let's see. Let's make our next move. I guess I can do no. No point in doing that. So we go like this. I don't really think this is actually helpful, but we get a little bit of damage from Midgard. Took down two percent. Not bad. Not bad. Uh oh. Um. Sometimes I think this line is kind of faint, so I don't really know where I need to be. Um. <laughs> let's see. What can we do? I guess I can move. Where is the line? Am I blind? I think I might be blind a little bit. I can't really see so the red outlines are where it's gonna hit so what i need to do is go here do like this and we'll just stay here i think this just we should be fine here or oh, only 80 800 damage that wasn't that good so i guess it's gonna switch position yeah and it knocked me back Oof, i don't like that but that's fine we're gonna do this do that wait a minute wait 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 i can't actually we're gonna do this we're gonna do this we're gonna get close to him I'm um, gonna plan our next move. So if I put him here, I'm gonna use Kraken or Klelkin to change tiles. So go like here. With that, we use Kelkin a little bit, and then we use Midgard to do a little bit of damage. Actually, if I wanted to do this, this probably isn't the best. I could go like that, move out of the way. Yeah, I guess that should be fine. Korax is going to be useless here. All I'm going to use him for is actually teleportation. So if you see, look, if I try to move in there, he's not going to be able to attack. So very useless in some of this boss's stages. So the only issue I have with him at the moment, um, I can go back like this and move away from the swipe. So this is the range. So I need to move out of that range if I don't want to get hit. But I don't think I can unless I do this. But I'm not going to be able to do any damage. Well, because I don't want to lose any HP, I guess I'll do that for now. But I don't think there is a reason for me to run away because I'm not going to die from that attack. But anyways, just to move away, that should be fine. And we need to move back in. To move back in, what I'm going to do is go over here. Um, or as you can see, I'm not going to be able to do any damage. But like I said, with Korax over here, I use him for teleportation sometimes if I'm unable to do any damage to the boss. We're going to do this and we should be fine. I'll probably be within his range of his attack, but I don't care too much. Wow, no damage at all. Okay, 600. I guess the boss has a lot of damage resistance stuff. 270. Oof, don't like that. Korax did a ton of damage with his ability there. Okay, that's fine. The boss didn't attack, so this is perfect. We're going to do... Uh, let's see, if I move this way, go like that. I can move all the way to that side, I guess. I guess I'll just do this. Don't really mind doing this. Oh, not a lot of damage, but that's fine. We'll go like this, go like this, 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 this. I mean, if I go there, I'll take a lot of damage. So I don't want to do that. Uh, let's see. Okay, I guess I'll just go like this. That's fine. Do a little bit of damage. It's not like, relatively too hard. There we go. So a lot of damage being dealt to the boss. It's going to be easy to clear this stage. So I don't think anyone should be um, stuck in any of this. So. We're going to try and move ahead like this. Do a little bit of damage. There we go. I'm probably within the range of his attack. But it doesn't really matter. I want to end this before I get to like 6 turns. So this is fine. Uh, the closer I am, the better I am. I will be. Uh, let's see. There we go. Korax does a bit of damage. Get that swipe. Yep. Wow, that's a lot of damage. But that's fine. We do this instead. Wait, let's see doesn't really matter because I'm going to use Flishy to teleport somewhere else. There we go, Flishy teleports just to get some more healing ability stuff. Um, if I do that, I'll go like this, this, yeah, it should be fine. Recover some of our HP. 
and now we can do a bit of normal attack um go like that should be fine there we go so close to beating the stuff maybe the next two turns we should be able to do that recover hp back thank you kelkin deals a little bit of damage Korax over here doing some beautiful beautiful damage once again i love that character obviously it wasn't very useful in this stage but who cares who cares anyways uh we do this instead teleportation thank you no damage at all but that's what we care about just doing the normal attack there we go so in my team i actually have like two characters who can teleport or like three characters if you include midgard but it doesn't really matter so we're going to skip through this we're going to go ahead and summon um, I'm probably going to summon on the, sh the banner with Sharona on the other characters. I don't think it's beneficial to do that, but who cares? I want to do a little bit of summon. I want to see if you guys will give me amazing luck on my summons. And let's see, where is it? Where is it? Recruitment. So we actually have beaten that stage. Now we are close to getting to chapter 8. We are right now in chapter 7, which is perfect. I hope in the summon I actually managed to pull a 6 star character come on game 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 is it six is it six i think it is a six come on sharona sharona thank you uh we got one five star one six star and a lot of four star character come on i want to skip uh this is a five star character please let's see who is this who is this fire character i guess i have to build a fire team very soon um let's see can we skip this three star uh who's this another three star we're gonna skip this Nadine, oh it's a new 6 star, I mean a new 4 star, sorry, this is a 6 star character, come on, who is this, Sharona, Sharona, no it's not, it isn't Sharona, oh my days, I hate her, I hate her, I really hate her, I have to build a fire team now, no, this sucks, I have her in my other account, I mean she's not bad, but I don't want to build a fire team with her, oh my days, where is Sharona, give me Sharona, I have a lot of fire team, uh, fire characters now, so I guess my main team or the next team I can build is going to be fire. So if we go over to my formation, the second team I have is lightning. As you can see, this is my lightning team, the characters I'm going to work on in the future. This is the fire one over here. Um, we're going to switch out Brooke. I'm going to put, where is she at? She's down here. She's actually pretty good. I believe she's a sniper character. Actually, let's go and take a look at her. Yeah, she is a sniper character. She does do a quite a bit of damage um who else i'm going to switch i did go get a five star character where is she at there she is oh i also have the other characters as well i have a lot of five star fire characters so i guess i will make a showcase on my fire team or i might make it on my lightning team tell me down in the comment section which one you actually want to see um i have a lot of five star uh, fire characters so i guess i can make that instead let's see who am i going to switch let's see this is just for now i'll probably will switch it out just a little bit actually we're going to take this character out i don't think they are that good and we're going to put nails i believe nails is actually pretty good so this is our fire team for now we're going to switch it out just a little bit she is perfect for a captain i guess and that is it so yeah that is all for today's video don't forget to like and subscribe stay tuned for more content on alchemy stars it's been your boy ac gamer and i'm out